Right everyone, now I did say I was going to sort out all of these charms. So, um, these are the bags of charms. I'm just randomly picking what there are. Um, I'll do, let me see if we can do another bag somewhere. Uh, <laughs> finding things to put them in. Ten. Right, there's 30 items, so we'll just have a quick look at them. Now, <laughs> this is actually a bead, but it's like, um, um, it's a Chinese bead, but you see, like a, a monk. But hey ho, you might want to put it somewhere. So I'm just going to tip that there. And we'll... Right, so this one you can put, uh, you know, like thread your uh, lace or fabric through and make that as a central piece. Just giving you ideas nice pendant there has a stone missing you can find something i'm sure to put in it if not let me know and i'll probably have something myself for you um those can be taken apart used as is that is a necklace oops let's have a look um gorgeous roses and flowers on it and i'm sure you can find somewhere to put it Again, this one. Look, and they're blue diamantes. And you've got a heart, which is coloured like that. Gorgeous big butterfly. You could add stones to that. That's quite heavy, but it's a tassel, a beaded tassel. Take it apart, you don't have to keep it as is. Um, a cabochon. I think that'll wash off. Um, a little from an earring large flower skull I just picked them out beautiful bracelet but lots of things on it that you could take apart and these are actually genuine um, rose quartz that's a rose quartz that's a rose quartz that's a rose quartz and the rest of pearl and uh, bling. That's a rose quartz as well. So, you know, that one. You have to find what to do with them. That one. A nice thick cross with a diamantium. The angels that I make. Oh, tassel thing. You find somewhere to put that, can't you? Dragonfly. There are a couple of... Uh, that actually fits onto a pearl so you can put a pearl on that see what you do is you stick the pearl on like that and then that dangles and there's another one nice flower oh another angel uh, this is a vintage one was a brooch cameo brooch diamante Another dangle one that's got a little claw on it so you can just dangle a charm off something. Some stones you can either take out or use as is. That's a made for you. A nice heart. Another. Just cut them and use the beads in that if you don't want to uh, thingy me bob. So there's 30 pieces there so I'm just going to... So that's bag number one. Now I... Say on this video if you want them because um, otherwise they're just going. And um, all of these are three pound a bag. So you've thirty items for three pound. That's good. So if I sold it all individually, I could get more for that. So that's bag number one. Now I've got some labels here. So let's use them and then you can say which bag you want. I will put it by if you need me to put it by for you. Um, bag number one. So I'll just put number one and a three pound a bag. Okay, let's just put that to one side. 
Okay, so this is bag number two. Let me just move that out of the way. So bag number two, we're going to go one, two, three. So, I've got a nice cross. Don't forget, you don't have to keep them the colour they are. You can paint them. You can do anything with them. Stamp them. Again, another one of those. Then we've got that beautiful one. And that one. And there is a... I think it's M&S, actually, that one. That one. You've got one of those. Pumpkin. That's gorgeous. A nice crystal one pendant like i say make a charm thing you know bag charm up use all your little bits and pieces one of those you've got that you can take apart what's this one this is like a keychain ring it's got several bits and pieces on and you've got another one that you can use somewhere and another one that one Bit of turquoise, beautiful big uh, shiny um, uh, diamante. Now, I, see, I take them out and use them somewhere. <laughs> You've got that one, another angel, a large heart with some smaller hearts on top. There's a nice one of those patterned hearts, bit of a, acrylic bits. There's a bit of bling you could add to something. Another one love the sun another angel connector bead and then you've got another one with a little claw i made these for bag charms but you can take them apart so that's another one there i am charging three pound because they're worth three pound you won't get them in the shops for that second hand or not it doesn't matter so that is bag number two not a bad bag for three quid you know okay let's have a look there was this one as well so we'll put this one in oh it need the stones there it needed fixing uh, which is a diamante one it's beautiful so we'll put that in um let's have a look so there's one two three four okay again 30 more charms so you've got that one i love that one it's quite vintage looking you've got the word paris on a chain one of those that go in the center of the flower the marker zeke one it's a clip an old-fashioned vintage clip the star the flower mother of pearl hearts You've got that one that just needs the stone putting in, but the stone's there. You've got some of these. That's actually bone. You've that one. You've got that one. You've um, a tassel. You've got that one. There's a tassel. You've several of these. I mean, I think we sell these for, uh, I think it's 40 pence, 45p each. So, you know. They are worth getting. Just more bits and pieces for you to play around with. Another heart and a leaf. So that's going in bag number three. Okay, okay. You'll have to say on this video if you want them. Now, um, I've not finished because I've still got all of those plus all of these to go through. There might be the odd thing I need to take out for myself, which is that one. I know that's mine. Okay. And that one. And that one. <laughs> no, we can let that go. 
Okay, so here we are. So I'm just going to do this one. One, two. Um, let's just put that one on there first. So, just to show you them, look, at, I'm sure somebody can make use of these. You're not a crafter if you can't. <laughs> Genuine agate. Oh, look at that. It's one of those that the door opens. Look, magnet. There. Then you've got a little droplets. Got the angel, oh beautiful angel, says it on it. The anchor, cabochon, large butterfly, flower, and this one you peel that back, look, and you've got a little bird underneath. I think they were the Tim Holtz ones, then. That one, nautical, Scottish one with the agate in. That butterfly, that one I actually made, but I've never used it, so it won't snip in here. But you make them out of wire, just put a picture on, and then add your little trimmings. There's a colourful one, can be taken apart. A nice big gemstone. Oh, that, no, that's mine, sorry. I'm going to replace that with this one. So, then you've got that one. And they are genuine pearls, they're real pearls. You have four pearls on that. You've got that one. Cameo. That one. Nautical again. Flower. Little cross. That one. Little butterfly. And a flower. So that is bag number four. Like I say, for three quid you can't go wrong and all of them are worth it. So, number five is this one. Wow. <laughs> Look at that flood tassel. And it's metal. And we've got some more bits that dangle and that's got a chain on it. A, um, a fancy clasp that I put on. So I made those. You have those. Actually, I'm going to change it. You have three of those. I don't want to do that because that's not fair. So we're just going to go, that's in place of that one, put that one down and take that one out, put that one down and take that one out. So you've got that, beautiful, then you've got those, that one, another earring, like a dangle earring, you've got that one. Oh, that'll hang nicely off a book. Look at that. And you've got that one. Oh, look at the Scottish stag, uh, stag head. Love and peace. Nice big flat acrylic hat. That's a glass one. Another Tim Holtz with a bird's nest. Butterfly hats. Nice big leaf. Oh, look at that. Pretty. That one. And that one. And that's got a pattern on that side. So, yeah. That's that one. So, that's bag number five. If you miss these, I'm sorry. But if you want them and you don't want to pay for them right now, but you want to wait till payday, nab them now, tell me what you want, and if they're available, I'll put them by for you. I have another one in reserve, just in case it's not available. Okay, that's it. Bag number five. Right, I'm just going to put these on the floor. And then we'll get another one done, number six. There we go. Bag number six. 
I did say this is what I was going to do because I don't need them. I take out everything I need. So we're going to put one of those in. So that I'm going to do two together. So six and seven we've got here, okay? So like I say, I'm not going to go over them all again. You can see what they're like. They're all in, you know, great condition. And, <clears throat> I mean, that's a vintage one. It's got a, a 19, 1928. 1928. You know, there's some real pretty things. Plenty of things for you to play around with. <laughs> but, and look at that. Just really pretty. Okay, so that's number six. And number seven. Now don't forget if you buy more than one you have to remember that the weight will affect the shipping and if you need if we need to charge you any more for shipping we will contact you uh, and let you know and invoice you for the um, extra if you've paid more than you should uh, from the shop because they set prices then then we will refund you the difference okay so now I'm just going to unload this lot as well and then it'll be probably just the smaller charms but you'll still get 30, okay? Right, oh, that's glass. So it's going in because somebody might use it. Um, let's have a look at this. I just might put some smaller charms in just to top it up there's 30 items you've seen me count them i might just put some more bits and pieces in just drop them in i'm not even looking them uh, looking at them i'm just putting them in what you do with them is up to you right let's go And I've got loads more coming in, folks. I've ordered some jewellery. They you know the big bags of jewellery that I take apart. Yeah. <laughs> yes, I have. So that's number eight. We're going to do bag number nine. And bag number ten. And then that's it for today. Can't remember what they came off. You just have to peel the back off. I haven't got the strength in my hands to do it. I do apologise. So that's 20, 21, 22, 23. Tim Holtz, look. 24, 25. That's vintage. 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. And a pair of uh, clippers that you can add chain to. 30 but i think we'll just go ahead and add some more just so you're getting a really nice collection and they're only small bits anyway so i want to make sure you get your money's worth now that goes in my miniature one where did i put my miniatures here we go. I have a little jar with miniatures that I can use. Yeah, as I come across bits. That's delicate. 
Right, you can put something in. Yeah, like a frame. Let's have a look. Oh, I'm going to do some more. You know what? I'm just going to pile them in. I don't care what you do with them. There. It's a three pound bag. I'd pay three quid for it anyway, so that's how I'm going to do it. But there's a lot more in than 30 now. And that is bag number 10. Oh, so I put it in number 10, so that's bag number 10. That's bag number 10. Right, what we're going to do is just have a look at this. Have got any more as well? Okay, we're just going to... You know what? Just want to make sure there's nothing in it that shouldn't be. And I'm just going to pile them in. Now, some of them are like that. They're like, they look like they've come off something. But, you know, just use them up. That's the whole point of it. You get little loose stones, look. Oh, that's another vintage clip, that one. I'm just trying to make it that you get fair bits. Oh, look at that. Enamelled. Love. Put you some charmy bits in. Uh, it's a different pin. Some angel's wings. Now, here's some bits and pieces. What have we got? A lock teddy bear. It's cute. A skull. London Tower. Bottles, charms. There's another vintage clip. Let's just see what we have. There's a shoe. Oh, just drop them in. Whatever it is. There's a spacer. Animal. More spaces, wing spaces. Some diamante bits and pieces. Just making sure there's nothing in there that shouldn't be. Look, a nice toadstool. Little charmy bits. These are what you, know, you can do your and they can do all sorts with them. Yeah? Just throw a load of bits and pieces in. Scissors. Owl. Letter R. Music note. Bird, hearts, couple more, and then that's that one done. Oh, and a fan. No, I'll keep the fan. Put that in my miniatures. Sorry. <laughs> I keep finding. Oh, look, there's a mother of pearl bird. Uh. Yeah. There's plenty in there. Plenty. Okie dokie. So that's that lot. And that's number nine. For three pound. Okay. They are, remember, taken from broken jewellery that I bought in huge bags. And I dismantle it all and keep everything so that you lot can have something to craft with. And it's not costing you a fortune. Let's just make sure we've got that letter in. Yeah. And I don't know. Oh, it's a pin. Look. It's a pin. So we'll put that in. Okay. So that's ten bags so far. Do you know what? I think I might just put all of that in the next one. Just want to make sure there's nothing in there. I don't want you coming back saying, oh, that were broken, Fee. 
because it's what I collect from everything that I have and everything I take apart. So, you know, like that is broken. No, where is it? That bit. But I saved it because I would put that in a flower step, you know, I'd glue it into a flower somewhere. I don't like to waste. Right, now it's a bag number 11. Oh, yeah, skull there. Lots of charms and bits and pieces. I'm just putting it all in. You can do with it what you want. You're buying it all as seen anyway. And there's loads in there. If you can't craft with that, you're not a crafter. <laughs> I keep saying that, don't I? So that is number 11, uh, three pound. So you can watch the video again. Tell me which ones you're interested in. Put them by if you want. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Take care and I'll speak to you all soon. Bye-bye for now. Grab them while you can.